asante sana bwana asifiwe bwana asifiwe god is good and all the time and that is nature wow the general general lindon buckingham and madam browning buckingham welcome to nairobi we are very honored to have you in nairobi and i'm sure the president will welcome you to kenya i can only welcome just still here just still in nairobi and thank you so much for your service thank you so much for that sermon this is a beautiful celebration for the salvation army and today we'll go down in our history of nairobi as being proud to have hosted this celebration of 100 years right here at ulinzi sports complex your excellency if you may allow me and our general and our territorial commander to just recognize a few leaders who've also come to celebrate they will not say something um, they will not uh, get an opportunity to speak i'll just recognize um, i have seen our former minister kazungu kambi is here to begin my coffee naona yule alikuwa mtangazaji wetu wa rais aliyestaafu eh, mwai kibaki sami louis hako hapa alikuwa mtangazaji kwa miaka mingi naona pia tuko na wawakilishi wodi kutoka nairobi we have mcs eh, mheshimiwa cecilia tuko na mheshimiwa mofaya huu ni mc wa kayole central tuko na mheshimiwa wairia kutoka eh, kayole north eh, ward Tuko na mheshimiwa Virginia kutoka hapa Langata. Na amekuja pia na apologies ya mbunge wa hapa uh, Langata anaitwa Jalas. Tuko na um, Dr. Damaris ambaye ni director wa Kemri. Na tuko na mheshimiwa Edith Nyenze kutoka Kitui. I think she is a sal salvationist. Asanti, asanti sana. This is indeed a great day for us. I am honored that you invited us that you invited me to be part of this celebration. Mimi nimekuwa karibu sana na Salvation Army. Kwetu kule nyumbani, nyumbani ni Nairobi lakini nyumbani zaidi Salvation Army kweli imekita kambi kule Western. Huko ndio ina inavuma. Si ni kweli? Na hapa nimeona watu wetu ya Kakamega, watu wa Vihiga, watu wa Busia Muko hapa karibuni sana na watu wa Bungoma pia wako hapa Mheshimiwa Dan Wanyama tulizungumza naye asubuhi alileta apology zake lakini alikuwa katika celebration ya territory ya West um, hapo awali Najua pia nikiona Mheshimiwa Nyenze kule ukambani pia ime, iko na mizizi ya Salvation Army Najua tuko na watu wa Kitui Tuko na watu wa Machakos, Masaku. Tuko na watu wa Makueni. Ama wako. Na najua nchi nzima. Salvation Army ilianzia kule Pwani. When you look at the history of a Methodist preacher called William Booth, who is the founder of the Salvation Army and who sent a telegram with just one word, others. That one word telegram is the foundation of the Salvation Army of thinking about other people and thinking about society. I am so drawn to the work you've done in this country. You have shown kindness, you have shown great service. Our thicker school of the blind has been a beacon of hope for so many Kenyans who had lost hope previously that they can go there and get an education they can go there and they can secure their future i just want to encourage you i want to encourage you because i have had the sermon the sermon has said a people of service a people of praise first of all a people of praise you cannot have space to be a complainer when you're a person of praise watu wa sifa hawezi kuwa watu wa kulalamika 
So kanisa yetu pia isiwe watu wa kulalami, kulalamika. Hata wakati mambo ni magumu tuwe na imani kwa Mungu na tumpe sifa. Pia tuwe watu wa maombi, a people of prayer. Na Romans inatuambia 13 that all authority comes from God to muombe rais wetu. Let us pray for our president. Let us keep praying for his government. If you are a person of praise and a person of prayer, you will understand the task that the president has and you will commit him daily before God. And your excellency we thank you because you have really tried. We have seen the shilling is gaining strength. Mambo ilikuwa mbaya hapo awali. Tunaomba sasa mambo iendelee namna hiyo. Tunafurahi tumekuwa na mazao kubwa sana kwa mashamba yetu. We've had an, a harvest. Last year our president led us eh, bona, eh, general our, pre, our president led us in prayer, national prayers at Nyayo Stadium to pray for rains. We had had the longest drought of 40 years. Many people laughed at us. That what are you praying for? That is an, an issue of nature. It is not an issue of God. The president went down on his knees. He is not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. And we got rain. And we got a bumper harvest that this country has never seen because of the power of prayer. A people of the word. During this time when we have so many fake preachers. Situmona wengine wanenda kando na neno la Bwana. Let the Salvation Army stay as a beacon of hope being a church where we like the Bereans in the Bible always consult the word of God and a people of proclamation and a people of service. Wacha niwape encouragement. Kwa sababu mkifanyia watu kazi Mungu hata wasahau. Waebrania sita kumi inasema kwamba Mungu hakosi haki. Yeye hata isahau kazi ambayo mliofanya na upendo kwa watu wake na ambao mnaendelea kufanya. That God is not unjust. He will not forget the good work you do for his people whom he loves and, the, and as you continue to serve his people. So muendelee na kazi hiyo. Sisi pia kama county ya Nairobi tunataka tushirikiane na Salvation Army. We want to partner with you. Unajua hata kufanya kazi nzuri ya Mungu kuna watu wale akina Sanballat na Tobias ambao watapanda kuzidi kupiga kelele ukifanya kazi nzuri. True religion that God considers faultless. James 1:27 is looking after the orphans and widows in their time of distress and keeping yourself from nani anajua from from defilement from pollution to be polluted from the world you know religion ambayo Mungu ana consider true salvation army is true religion but even as you do it there will be naysayers huko Nairobi tuliona watoto wetu wengi wanakosa kwenda shule kwa sababu ya njaa Tukazindua na rais majikoni ya kupikia watoto wetu. Tukajenga majikoni kumi. Kila siku Nairobi watoto 184,000 wanapata chakula kwa shilingi tano peke yake. Taking care of those orphans. Lakini hata hivyo kuna wale kina Tobias wametupeleka kotini, kuna wale bado wanatupigia kelele hawataki watoto wakule kwa sababu ya siasa. Tafadhali naomba Salvation Army muwaombe watu hao najua muombe sana waokoke na hiyo pepo mbaya ishindwe ishindwe kwa hiyo tunasemanga riswa nikimalizia <laughs> we want to partner with you najua Nairobi Central kanisa yetu ya hapo town OTC e, yule my name sake Arthur Lord amenialika Nitakuja najua mko na changamoto moja ama mbili kwa hiyo area yenu kumejaa matuktuk na kumejaa chuuzi tunataka kuwe na mpangilio because our god is a god of order isn't it so i will come to fellowship with you mkiniona next time nimevaa white msinikeme munikubalie tu if you see me in white next time please the general please allow me 
au territorial commander kiama allow me ju napenda hiyo white na leo nilifikiri rais atavaa white unajua anavanga kaunda hiyo uva ile kaunda yake kali ya kala white lakini leo hajaivaa so your excellency welcome this church has set a great example i always admire the brass band that we have um, in the salvation army you are an amazing amazing team i hope mtakuja mfunze kanjo kanjo wetu pia tuwe na brass band kama yenu ya salvation army kwa hayo mengi hongera congratulations the territorial commander of uh, Kenya East and uh, madam thank you we will want to pay a courtesy call to you to see how we can partner stronger with the salvation army kwa sasa it is my privilege and honor kumwalika rais wetu tumpigieni makofi akija kutuzungumzia rais William Samoe Ruto Asanteni asanteni sana tafadhali tuketi thank you very much our good friend and brother Lyndon Buckingham and your dear wife Browning on behalf of the government and people of Kenya let me take this opportunity i know many have already extended a warm welcome to you but let me join them in welcoming